we just got back from island hopping in the Canaries and it was awesome. Every day we did something really cool, seeing dolphins and orcas, we saw lemurs and fed giraffes, we saw parrots and more dolphins, we went sailing, we went on a catamaran, we explored volcanoes and ate delicious food and walked around on beautiful massive beaches and just had the time of our lives. And while we were there, we of course had pet sitters for Lambo and Nia, and they did such a great job. Welcome back to the channel, my poodle and parrot pals. And if you're new here, welcome. If you're a dog or parrot lover, you've come to the perfect place or perfect place where I share lots of dog tips, parrot tricks, and dance a lot of cuteness and in today's video I'm going to share a lot of mentally stimulating games that you can prepare for your dog whether you're at home or on vacation so they can have fun and stay mentally stimulated mentally stimulating games for dogs are interactive activities that are going to challenge your dog's brain and provide them with mental exercise Sniffing is a natural and instinctive behavior for our dogs. So offering opportunities and allowing them to engage in sniffing is going to be a great thing for your dog's mental and physical well-being. Did you know that 15 minutes of sniffing is equivalent to a 1.5 kilometer walk for your dog? First, let's talk about how you can incorporate mentally stimulating games into your dog's routine. And we have a smoothie. Oh yeah, baby. So first off, you're going to need to assess your dog's abilities and their interests. Determine what type of mental stimulation games your dog is going to enjoy and be able to complete. Consider their age, breed, and energy level. You also wanna make sure that you mix it up. Offer a variety of mental stimulation games to keep things interesting and prevent boredom. These types of games that have sniffing opportunities are great. Sniffing is important as it's the primary way that they get information about their environment and it helps them relieve stress. With games, you want to start simple and begin with easy games and then gradually increase the difficulty level as your dog becomes more confident and skilled. As your dog plays with these games, evaluate your dog's progress and observe your dog's response to the games and adjust the level of difficulty or types of games needed. You also want to make sure that you're setting aside a dedicated time for these games on a regular basis to play with your dog and make it a bonding experience. Engage with your dog during the mental stimulation games and offer positive reinforcement for their efforts. And don't forget to hide treats inside of the games. Now let's get into the games that you can offer your dog. The fun stuff. So let's start off with perhaps the funnest game, which is hide and seek or hide and scent. All you do is you just hide treats or even your dog's favorite toys around the house and encourage them to find it. This game can be adjusted in difficulty level as your dog becomes more familiar and skilled with it. An alternative is also setting up an obstacle course in your home or your yard and have your dog navigate it. These two types of games also provide your dog with physical exercise. The next one is puzzle toys and there are so, so, so many different cute ones out there or you can create your own. And these games usually require your dog to solve something so that they can access a treat. Another great one is training games. Incorporate training into playtime by having your dog perform tricks and obedience exercise in exchange for treats. This is a yummy one, licky mats or a Kong. Licky mats and stuffed Kongs provide mental stimulation, improve dental health, reinforce good behavior. They promote slower eating, but they're also a distraction during stressful times. Here we have a Nerf dog toy, and I've just filled this with some dry food. These types of toys provide physical exercise and mental stimulation for dogs, promoting overall health and happiness through play and interaction. Next we have snuffle mats, and these are awesome. I've talked about snuffle mats tons of times. They provide mental stimulation by encouraging natural foraging behaviors, 
and allowing dogs to use their sense of smell to find treats. Now this last one, I call it folded towel fun. All you need is a towel and some treats. You fold a towel and in between each fold, hide a treat and give the folded towel to your dog to unravel. You can also make it more challenging by intertwining it into another toy or tying it. Lambo is very well versed with this game, so I try to make it as challenging as possible and I'm combining a puzzle toy with the folded towel and it is so much fun. Having a dog and parrots, I've noticed that mentally stimulating games are just important for our pets in general. So make sure that you're creating these opportunities for your furry and feathered friends. By the way, Lambo loves my yoga mat. Every time I pull out the yoga mat, he thinks it's just time to play and he just loves to play on my yoga mat. As soon as he sees the yoga mat, it's like playtime. Oh, here we go again. So you can imagine that it makes it very difficult for me to actually do yoga when Lambo is always trying to play. This game that I created for Lambo here took him about 10 minutes of sniffing and physical exercise to get it completed and get all those treats out. So as you can see, these games are just really great ways for your dog to have indoor entertainment and just make sure that you're keeping them healthy and happy, not only physically, but mentally and emotionally as well. So yeah, that's it. These are our favorite games to play at home with Lambo. Providing your dog with mentally stimulating games is going to provide them with numerous benefits, including better physical health, improved cognitive function, less anxiety, better obedience, an improved bond with you, and prevention of boredom and destructive behavior. Regular mental stimulation can improve your dog's problem solving skills, memory, and decision making abilities. And these games can reduce anxiety in dogs by providing a positive outlet for their energy and emotions. And also it distracts them from the thing that gives them anxiety. So this is why we left these games for Lambo when we were away, because we knew that it was gonna be a positive outlet for him and it was going to also be a really nice and fun distraction. So all in all, Lambo gives all of these games a 10 out of 10. So provide your cute little doggies with as many games as you can to provide them with fun and interactive activities and also strengthen your bond with them. That's it for today, my poodle and parrot pals. I hope that you found this video helpful and fun for you and your dog. Don't forget to like this video, comment, and subscribe for a good vibe. And I'll see you guys in the next video.